Hundreds of people lined the streets in Kailua to get a glimpse of the president's motorcade as it arrived at his vacation compound. KITV's Kaoki Kerr continues team coverage live from Kailua. Kaoki? Hi, Gary. And the Obama family and their entourage are safely ensconced here behind me uh, on Kailuana Place here in Kailua off of Kalaheo Avenue. I'll tell you the biggest change that we've seen since he was here last year at the same location is the security. Last year, we were able to drive all the way into Kailuana uh, Place and uh, get pretty close to his compound. This year, as you can see, it is a different story. You see people there having to go through a security checkpoint. There are Secret Service agents. There are Honolulu police officers. They don't let anybody in unless they live there or are authorized guests. So a big change in security, obviously, because this time he's president. He's no longer president-elect as he was last year. And we also saw a change in the size and the scope of his motorcade that came through here about two and a half hours ago, much bigger than it was last year. Take a look. As soon as the president landed at Hickam Air Force Base on the other side of the island, police shut off traffic on Kalaheo Avenue, which runs parallel to Kailua Beach. The crowd grew to more than 150 people as drivers who couldn't drive anywhere got out to watch the motorcade. We're coming home from shopping. That's, that's why I'm here. So once, uh, I guess once they let us go through, I'll, I'll head home. Some folks came in off the beach to watch the president's arrival. Well, we were just surfing over at... Uh over at Castles and then came out to head to her house and saw the uh, commotion and we're like, oh, what's going on? Turns out Obama's in town. Other motorists were frustrated by the 45-minute wait on Christmas Eve, like this man, who was trying to pick up his son at a church. No, I want to know how long it's going to take because I have a son on the other side that needs to be picked up at 3 o'clock. And I've been in traffic from 2 o'clock. Then the motorcade rounded the corner from Mokapu Boulevard onto Kalaheo Avenue, and the crowd cheered. The motorcade is much bigger compared to the president's last visit during the holidays last year, and neighbors here are excited. President of the most powerful nation in the country, we feel a couple of weeks of inconvenience is, 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 our, is our duty as citizens to allow our president to have a nice vacation here in the, in the, in the, in the land that he grew up in. We're back here live in Kailua, where the Obama family is uh, in for the night. There's a full lid, as they say, uh, folks who cover the president. That means they are not going anywhere tonight. And the Secret Service agents are coming and going. We ran into some of them at Burger King up the road, which had closed early for the evening. They were kind of upset. They couldn't grab a Burger King meal and had to uh, venture out and maybe find some local grinds tonight. That should be an interesting adventure for them. Uh, also, there's an interesting adventure on the ocean, on the beach out in front, and in the canal uh, alongside of the compound much higher security there. We're going to show you what that looks like tonight at 10 o'clock. Reporting live from Kailua, Kyoki Kerr, KITV4 Island Television News.